Hello, and today I'm going to show you how to burn Dreamcast games onto your CD and then play it on your Dreamcast. Um, so let's begin. Um, you need to download the program Disk Juggler. So I already have it, so let's type in Disk Juggler right here. There we go. It's all open now. Okay, there. It may freeze when you put the CD in for like maybe five seconds. There you go. And then you get you get this option when you um well hold on. When you start the program you get this little gray box and stuff. You press the plus button here. That selects new. You're gonna have a bunch of stuff. You just see the second to last option, burn disk images, you press OK. This comes up. Um, we're going to today be burning a CDI, which this only burns CDI images. Um, if you have any other image like ISO, NRG, I think those are good with alcohol 120%. See, But for now, I'm going to use um, Disk Juggler for CDIs. Um, so... What we're gonna do now is we're gonna check off the destination, which is our um, hard drive or a CD drive that we used to burn. I already got it, my HP one. And you click on here, the source. You press desktop or whatever you have it, and you look for the CDI. Okay, once you have it, you go to advanced, little tab here. Click on op mode two right here mode 2 for mode and you're gonna check off raw write so that just raw it just copies the data and not just like any spe anything special so raw write keep everything unchecked except raw write and this thing that's always been checked um okay well once all that's done simply press the start button and press yes because if you press no then you have to restart the whole thing press yes and there we go it's already burning so what it's doing now is that it's just you know getting ready you know preparing the drive preparing everything so now the catch should yeah there you go I spoke too soon and then the cycle should be presenting up and then once that's done the CD should come out of the drive and enjoy your Dreamcast may be a little bit it may be a little confusing because once when you put the game in the Dreamcast may do that sound like it's not detecting the CD and then once the um, once you go into the menu and you press the controller, it'll go white and then go back to the Dreamcast logo and then boot again real. Um, if you can't boot off the game, like if you can glitch that happens that when you put the CD in the drive, it loads it as a music file, then that means that you need to get a um, Utopia boot CD, which is... Um, everywhere you can find it, just um, look for Utopia Boot CD. Um, it's exactly the same way as you burn this thing. And what that Boot CD does is that it lets you play games from other countries on the same system. So if I get a game from, let's say, I get a game from China like Shenmue 2, I'll be able to play it for, um, for free because Utopia Boot CD lets me play it. Or you just buy a Dreamcast, whichever one you want. Whatever, thanks for watching.